lip balm on your ears before you put earrings in whoever told me that thank you so much like that is such a game changer i'm also growing my eyebrows out at the moment which i'm actually quite vibing with these are like summery trousers and this is like a winter top I'm also really cold right now, but I wanted to spice it up. No tracksuit bottoms today. Look at me. Please get out the way, boo. Holly's actually dressed up today. <laughs> I may as well be in the freezer right now. It's actually freezing. I was like, oh, we're gonna like put together in a polo neck. But no, we have to put this jumper on. It doesn't go with my trousers, but you can't see my trousers right now. So, you know, this is fine. It is Thursday. We're going to do some organizational stuff. I need to sort out my folders. And we also have an official lecture. We're going to attend the lecture on Zoom, obviously, but it's not like pre-recorded. And so I just thought, you know, I may as well look as if I was going to go to that lecture. It's got like a scheduled time. Wow, like that's just unheard of in the world of online university you know but anyways um all this whole lemon is so good right now it's warming me up all the jewelry i'm wearing today as well is from anna luisa so i have spoken to you guys about anna luisa before i just love them as a company and what they stand for and everything the company is fully carbon neutral everything from like sourcing of their materials and the manufacturing of the products to their shipment and then disposal it's fully like carbon neutral which is honestly amazing everything is like so well made but it is really reasonably priced so everything is from 39 us dollars upwards and at the moment the reason why i'm kind of like talking about it now is because they have their huge black friday sale going on so yeah if you click the link in the description box you can check out like their limited offers for black friday obviously i'm not one to like over consume anything but because it is black friday and there are discounts if you do want anything now is a good time to get something they have so many different like designs and colors something basically to fit everyone and to suit your style and what you're into in jewelry i for example like gold stuff and we know how i feel about my hands i often don't wear rings because i don't want to draw attention to my hands but i do love a good necklace and i do love earrings this is the b necklace as soon as i saw this i knew this was so me it speaks yoga to me and that's why i really like it the earrings that i'm wearing today are the mini huggy hoops like you can never go wrong with a classic little hoop i never really say cute but these are the definition of cute earrings okay i'm obviously not wearing these today but the other earrings that i was very recently sent were their scarlet hoops they're not like huge huge hoops like that go like down to here but they're like a double hoop thing and they're not ones that you kind of have to hook around your ear they just have like a prong that you put through your ear if this makes sense and then a bus fly back so the others are quite big they're like chunkier big mama hoops right if i was going out and i really wanted to draw attention to my earrings you know and my ears i would put those in so yeah that is anna luisa my jewelry chat of the day Okay, so after doing some admin, the first bit of organization that I needed to do was something to do with finances, which I really don't like doing. But it feels good to get it done, and I also just updated my weekly plan in my bullet journal. I actually think I'm gonna put the light on in my room because it's so dark. It's not acceptable at this time of day. This lecture was at 1.30, I mean 1.30, and I turned my light on. I was just not happy. But anyways, this lecture was on a type of cancer therapeutic. It was specifically looking at more personalized treatments in lung cancer, which is the most common cancer worldwide alongside breast. After the lecture, because everything was still fresh in my mind, I decided to write up the notes and fill in any missing gaps. I just finished writing up the notes from that lecture. I wrote things in different colors according to the way I usually color code my notes. There was just so much going on in that lecture. It got to the point when I was like, I don't know what to write down anymore because he was talking so fast and there was just so much information on all the sides. So I kind of took a deep breath and was like, just focus on what they're saying, absorb that information write down the odd key word or key sentence and then afterwards I've just been through it as I said and that's good because it's still fresh in my mind and you know it's actually not as bad as I thought the lecture it was really interesting but he was just going way too fast this though why is my door open I hate it when my door is open no does anybody else feel like so exposed when they have their door open I just cannot work with my door open anyways yeah I have this massive pile of notes 
and that is my main organizational task of the day to get it into this ring binder we finally have a ring binder we also have dividers that is what i'm gonna do when i get back from a walk because i'm gonna go on a walk before it gets dark at like 4 p.m but yeah it was good to have a lecture i suppose um sorry i cannot find where i'm putting these notes right now see it's already getting too large it came quite sunny before for like 10 minutes and then the sun had enough but yeah i've also wait i actually don't know where my phone is i'm gonna do a video about procrastination but one method if you want to know i basically hide my phone and i just forget where it is um it's in this drawer like i often put it in the same place but it's just out of sight out of mind it's fine we have no notifications i'm not very popular so it's great so it was getting quite dark and the sun was setting so bali and i just watched the sunset for a bit and then when i got back i basically had my lunch which i have in two parts i have some salad which is really weird and then i have oats afterwards slow it down like that Kiwi flowers never get old. I love making these things. If you watch what I'm doing carefully, you can work out how to do it. But I did make an Instagram story and that is pinned to my profile if you are interested. Okay, so onto my main organizational task of the day. So I started by organizing my notes, putting them into distinct sections. And then on a post-it note, I just wrote down the names of the sections that I would use as titles for each of my dividers, which I then just transferred. Now, because these are paper dividers, what I do next is something that my sister told me ages ago. I get some sellotape and I basically laminate them almost. It just means that they don't rip as easily and they also look a bit neater. As you can see, I just wrap over the sellotape and then after that, I will get some scissors and just trim the edges. And then the final step is basically to just put everything in order and then into my folder. Oh, and then I normally just put some sellotape over the holes for the first divider because that is the one that gets used most and will often rip. It is assignment time. We have to get this thing under the word limit. Otherwise, it's going to stress me out. Set a timer for one hour. One hour. Starting now. She got it. Lemonade. My assignment is so close to being done. For this one, we have a 2000 word word limit. However, we are always allowed 10% extra. I'm in the final stages of proofreading it and just, as I said, making sure that it's under the word limit of 2200 words maximum. <laughs> no, I don't need my radiation on, don't turn it on. I like to be cold. Yeah. The Ice Maiden. Is that a 13 inch screen, by the way? Yeah, no, 11 inch. Why? Oh, right, okay. You want a MacBook? Well, I might get. I Emily said I, I ought to get a, um, um, an Air something thing. A Be MacBook Air? Because they have this new <laughs> processor in. You want the big one, though, don't you? Well, because my eyes are bad and I'm old. But um, uh, Well, that screen's big enough, no? Emily's one is slightly bigger than that, isn't it? No, they're the same size. Well, that's 13 inch then. Oh, must be a... Uh... What? Oh, I don't know, darling. I thought you young people would, might know. I don't know this technologically. Oh. <laughs> 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 All right, I'm not happy about that, darling. I'm going for a run. Don't, don't go to bed too late to make sure you put the radiator on. No, I'm Shouldn't not putting the radiator on. Then. I'm not putting the radiator on. No. Oi, look at me. Oi. Oi. These screenshots are some screenshots I obviously took but they have text on and I didn't write them up the other day because I didn't have time slash kind of didn't want to 
So we're gonna do it now. We're gonna write up this information. I'm officially losing the plot right now. This blind was up because I had the window open. I have to be cold when I work. Like really, really cold. Freezing cold. In the evenings. In the mornings, no, don't like being cold. But in the evenings, I have to be cold. I'm just very picky with the temperature I need to be at particular times of the day, okay? It helps with the motivation, I'm not even gonna lie. Like, I have to be cold in the evening to feel motivated. In the mornings, can't feel cold. Have to feel cozy. There's a difference. I don't know why I'm talking about this. I just need to shut up right now. So, as you'll see in my next weekly vlog, we basically have virtual kind of lab things. Cause you've been running my mind all day. I then just finished off by clearing my MacBook and doing some final emails of the day. Ay ay ay, Alexa, Alexa, turn the light on. Okay. Nothing, nothing. Alexa, turn the light on. Yes. Okay. Yes, we get there eventually. I just wanted to talk to you about this book. You get launched in so quickly. As the reader, it's like, whoa, what is going on? You meet like so many characters at the start. All of their little stories and scenarios get introduced and there are so many names. I'm like, wait, what, who, why, where? What is going on? What happens at the start is like, whoa. I did not expect that. Well, I kind of did expect it from the blurb, but I didn't expect it to be that type of person. I'm not gonna give spoilers because I'm quite good at doing that. I read before I go to bed because it helps me sleep. I get transported to the world of the book and I then just like go to sleep. This oh, is yeah. Emily's evening setup. Quite nice. We have a plant. It's Khaleesi. So, you know, I'm going. Wait, did you make that up? Well, you know, Game of Thrones. There's a character called Khaleesi, and she's the, she is the mother of dragons. So, I thought I'd change it to Khaleesi because we've got the. And she is the mother of my plants, the cacti. Repeat the name again Khaleesi. Khaleesi. So, Ka Leaf C. Right. How long did it take you to come up with that? Three weeks. <laughs> Khaleesi. Um, did you water her? I did, although one of her, look, that, the white one of them is dying. Oh dude, dying oh, already! No. What is it? What is it's it? It's called Donuts. You might have heard it. Uh, right. No, I don't think I've heard it yet. Right, it's called Young Bay, but I absolutely love Young Bay. Beat this song! <laughs> okay, so Kenzie Ziegler's new song is such a vibe and the music video is so good as well. So we just watched that and then we chatted for a bit, laughed a lot. I also just took pictures on Emily's phone to spam her because, you know, why not? It's her new phone. And then after that, I had a shower, had my dinner and got ready to go to bed. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video getting organized with me. Like it if you did, comment down below, subscribe and I will speak to you very soon.